Brandon has got back with the fittings and all that. We actually just got back from the hardware store. We had to go grab a, another fitting and a, 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 a nipple extender. So we've done got our oil line built that goes from there to the front of the motor right there. Uh, we got our fit and fix for the fuel line right there. That was an issue because the fuel line was running straight into this water, this water hose here. Um, got our fuel line back on. Now Brandon is working on putting this nipple into these fittings right here, as you can see. And this is where that goes. This goes right down there in that hole right there and you can see that it's very tight between the mid plate and the heads so we had to have an extender to get it up above the mid plate and while we're in the hardware store just a second go getting that piece of pipe this is not sponsored or endorsed but if you guys are in the south with the humidity anti-monkey butt that's all I'm going to say. If you've ever used it, you know what it is. Brandon and Chris are sitting on the job. Look at them. Union break. They're watching some racing on TV. They rained out last night, so uh, they're running some features during the day. They're sitting here watching this. Uh, meanwhile, what's going on here? I don't think we've even done an intro video, so hey, it's Friday. Um, but anyway, what we're working on is this radiator hose here is too short. Or it needs another fitting. Brad thinks if he puts another fitting on, he make it work. So, call it around, try to find one. Because uh, this is just not uh, one you can go to the parts room yet. The other radiator hoses, like we used to run, the gates, you can go to the parts store and get those. But those are tanks, which I, we do have one of those on the bottom here. That's what that one is. But this one is that braided expensive stuff. So we'll see what he's got to say. He's been calling around to see if he can see if he's found any. Have you found any information? No. All right. So now we're still working with this radiator hose. Chris messed it up. Chris did it. I did it. It was kinked either way, so they were trying to get the kink out of it, and it's still kinked, so. Last well, thing we got. How many hoses have you already made? Too many. <laughs> last one. I had dreams about radiator hoses last one. Last hose. All right, guys, so they put the radiator hose on there just so they can check everything out. It does still have a little kink there. And you can see that right in that Christopher over here working on timing. We've got timing light over here. They're figuring it out. Still gotta scale this thing out and check set up and all that, but we're getting closer. We'll show y'all what it sounds like in just a second crank. What was the oil pressure? They just must have had it high. Huh? They must have just had it high.
they're getting it on the scale pads. We're gonna get it scaled out and make sure it's uh, where it should be because this is an all, all aluminum motor, so obviously it's gonna be lighter. I know we're still gonna get crazy questions just like we always do, um, but it is an all aluminum motor, so it's gonna be lighter, so that's why we're scaling it out. guys so we got it on the scales right now Brandon and Chris are putting fuel in it and then we're gonna check check it out on the scales they're discussing what we what we need to weigh what we should weigh and all the good stuff bring it yeah yeah there you go all right so we found a hose bring it up there you go TJ offered took care of our hose needs. Now they gotta cut it to the right length. That's the tricky part, huh? That was a lot better than driving to Atlanta. Yeah. Felt like we drove to Atlanta going all the way ball. Tell him about the screw. <laughs> <laughs> the hunt the front tv oh there I, I forgot that they were actually racing that i thought it was practice anyway on the front tv we're watching that while we're in the shop working on our race car our plans were originally to be there but uh, we didn't we didn't make it so we're gonna watch it on tv and go super racing tomorrow how's that sound brandon does that sound better sound cheaper yeah <laughs> We didn't plan on hose <laughs> Ho or hose? Hose. <laughs> uh oh, uh oh. Brandon's got a friend. Alright. Take number two. Brandon's fixing to cut this one. Brad said he's out on it. He's not doing anything. So Brad's over there drinking this water. So here we go. Oh gosh. To the end of the table. Hey. <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> I didn't know she was crying. What happened? What are you doing? Go no, look at Chris. Oh God, here we go. Guys are still over here working on, working on the stuff. On hoses still trying to get a radiator hose squared away we did they did scale it you did did you get the scale in the way you wanted it that's the way it's gonna run all right good all right so they got it scaled check by and all that stuff this is probably the only time to scale it with this motor unless we have some really good changes but uh brandon's got something to say so i gotta cut the camera off all right here's the moment of truth I like it so much better without that protector. Yeah. That's probably what was doing it. Is the best one not up? Can y'all find it? 
There ain't no telling where it's at, honestly. Look at Brandon. He might fix the problem. Good. It ain't got a kink this time. About an inch too long. You cut that inch off? Hey, it looks like it's gonna work. Maybe our only problem they had to fix. Brandon's fixed it. Mr. Fix It. Brown's making notes. He's making setup notes. You'll see these setup notes. Uh oh, he will show us. He's showing a rage. He's got a freaking long glove in there. Yeah. That's how you win races, Ashley. You gotta take notes. <laughs> That's how you run last, too. You gotta take notes. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, did a mighty fun job, Brandon. Mm. Much better than having to drive all the way three hours to Summit in Atlanta, McDonough, or whatever, how do you say that? Kids are out here playing. I'm playing in the pool, baby. Go, go play basketball. I'm going in a way. <laughs> <laughs> Maggie's uh, being a little bit aggravating right now. But anyway, that's going to pretty much finish this up for tonight. You guys can kind of see what's going on. They're just topping everything off with fluids and um, all the good stuff going to let her down and she's ready to be loaded up. Love that, and, yes, you would. <laughs> be loaded up in the trailer. Let's, let's glue it there. No. Chris, let's glue it. Let's glue Goofy. Yeah. Maggie would love that. <laughs> but let's make a Goofy car next year. Let's like make a Mickey Mouse. Brandon Boyd, if you're watching this, no. talk him into it. No. Brandon. No. Brandon. Brandon. No. My guy. No. Friend. Need you. To, need you to talk him into it. Yeah. But anyway, we appreciate all of our partners. Works Food Performance Parts, Barry Apparel Co., KT Heating and Air, Fat Daddy's Crew out of Lafayette, Indiana. All South Signs of Graphics by BB Designs, Hammers Graving, Vincent Race Engine, Penske Racing Shocks, Brand Transmission, Gorsuch Performance, and Penske Racing Shocks. I think I'm ever said that. Um, but appreciate all of those guys who make every bit of this possible. Special thanks to Wendell for getting us a super power plant. Thanks to Wendell, or thanks, thanks to Brandon, Brandon for being our uh, go getter. Um, thanks to Ashley. For being for mounting up our tire last night. <laughs> Thanks to Brad for aggravating the piss out of everybody. Thanks to Chris for getting fired a bunch. What? You did it. Chris. Glue it. He can't say no. I'll just put it in my pocket and then it comes in, I'll sit it down. <laughs> <laughs> oh, are you on your bike? I had a big old spot on her knee, didn't I? Huh? I had a big old spot on her knee. Mm -hmm. But it's really not bad. It's just, it's, it's just, it just scraped it. She fell earlier. Got another scrape on her knee, but. Appreciate all of you guys watching. Hope you guys have enjoyed these videos the last couple of days. We will be racing tomorrow night at Talladega Short Track. You guys will probably see this the same day. You'll see this in the morning. So it will be tonight. So if you're in the area, come out to Talladega Short Track to support us. We'll be running Super Late Mall. It's just a regular show for us Super Late Mall guys. What? This, yeah, it's our Sportsman Motor right here. Chris, Chris. Now you know they already cried about everything. They really we cried about this. Everybody's already jealous. Don't make them eat more. <laughs> <laughs> Then that's gonna finish us up tonight. We hope you guys have a great night and uh, good luck to everybody racing this weekend.